Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're crooked, I'm sorry. My little setup is just not cooperating and is literally falling apart every single time I try to adjust it. So this is what you get. You get a crooked video courtesy of me. So I'm actually kind of nervous. This is my first video I've ever done actually doing my own makeup. Like I've done videos where my daughter does my makeup, but I'm really shitty at makeup. Like just disclaimer, I'm bad at makeup. I never use the right brushes. Um, I do all the wrong techniques. So if you're looking for like <laughs> how to do your makeup, this isn't it. This is bad. Don't, don't do anything I'm about to do. So a few months ago, or maybe it was just a month ago, I ordered the Jeffree Star Summer Mystery Box and it came with the Star Ranch palette. It's beautiful. It's a masterpiece. And it's one of my favorite Jeffree Star palettes like ever. So this is what it looks like inside. You can see I've, I've kind of fucked up this one. That's what I mean by being bad at makeup. Like, look, who does that? Who can even do that to makeup? So obviously I have like face makeup on or you'd be scared and probably have nightmares following this video if I did not right now. Eyebrows like filled in. Don't, don't clown on me about my eyebrows, okay? I know they're like wrong. Okay, I get it. I, I know. But I figured I would just try to do a little look from this palette and this palette alone and show you guys because why the fuck not why not even if you don't learn anything which you won't even if i look ugly in the end which i probably will we can chit chat you know have a time in honor of jeffree star i'm gonna be getting high as fuck i don't know about you but you know i suggest doing it so. then we'll be on the same level you know you won't think i'm as dumb Actually, I take back my suggestion that you should smoke too because YouTube doesn't like that. That's a no-no and I just did it. Whoops. All right, let's go balls deep into this palette and see what the fuck my untalented ass can make from it. I think I'm gonna do like a light, light brown base using this one right here just to like, you know, make it blendable, which honestly, in the past two years, every time I've done my makeup, I... <laughs> would put down like just like a skin tone colored base kind of just because like I saw it in a YouTube video once <laughs> and I didn't understand why and once you understand why it kind of makes more sense even if you're bad at it like it just you want something that's going to blend out into something cute and a lot of times I would just use like a white ass one because I'm white as fuck as fuck I didn't understand why and a lot of times when I would try to blend it out in the end like it would look horrible like really fucking bad i kind of think i know which colors i'm gonna use in this so i'm just gonna do i'm gonna start off with the light brown i'm pretty sure i'm not supposed to use a brush this big or like use this much product but like here we are i just do small little circles in whichever direction because i don't know what the fuck i'm doing and i heard you're supposed to do like soft small circles so i do and it's like i don't know i've never literally never cared enough to pay attention to which way you're supposed to do it like out of order and so i just do it both ways just like circles it in circles out bitch uh -huh. now we have like whatever that is so what we have so far just a little a little darker than my skin just like whew. so at the end when you want to blend it out because a bitch needs to blend with how bad i place my makeup this is helpful looking at this beautiful thing i think i'm gonna do some kind of halo eye effect, hopefully. We'll see how that turns out. Um, so I think I'm gonna use the browns, Wyoming, and Open Range. And I fucking love Old Jeff. Like I said this when I did my unboxing and opened this palette. Old Jeff is like the prettiest color blue my brain could ever fucking dream of. Really, it, it's it's my kind of blue. Like I don't like soft baby blue so much i don't like dark blue and usually if it's just like somewhere in between blue it's not this blue like this kind of blue i swear i've already tried to adjust the camera so many times um okay so all, also just like disclaimer from earlier that i should put in all my brushes are dirty filthy dirty mixed with colors so that's the thing so again i never use the right brushes this literally you can see like two different colors just on this one. Oh my god Please don't clown me in the comments too hard, my god. Okay. So I think I'm gonna go in with Wyoming. Thick. We're gonna get it thick. Look at all that shit. Thick. 
so that's a thing like it's actually like why is it looking better than it normally does i mean it's early on literally like first little color i'm putting on my face so i won't get i won't get too excited but like that literally looks better than it normally does like what again i know not good but like for me it is i'm gonna use the same brush I'm literally just gonna take the same brush and just the lighter more sparkly uh brown color open range this bitch right here i'm just gonna like put it like more towards the front you know you know i'm just gonna like round it over the top just ever so slightly to connect the two browns kind of Again, don't do my techniques. They're bad. So, so far it's a, about usual for me. Not good, but not horrendously ugly to where like, if someone came over, I would lock myself in a room. I'm trying to use like natural light because that seems to like work best for bitches, but like not this bitch. Oh fuck, fuckity fuck. We need another light. probably going to use either the slightly lighter blue that I showed you a minute ago or the one that I showed you a minute ago. But first we need to, I like to like prime level area, which I don't think that's right. I don't think that's what you're supposed to do, but like I do it because I like that shit on thick. That just looks so wrong. That gesture was not that. That was, yeah, never just ignore what just happened. So like I said, I'm gonna like prime that little area where I'm gonna put the blue. This is my gross primer, ew. I can always tell with me which one's my bad one because there's usually like a fucking pink on the actual like applicator. I'll just peek on this one too. Are they both fucked? Shit. Oh my God. Okay. There's pink all for both of these. <gasps> well, that's fucked. And again, I know this is literally not what you're supposed to do. Cause like I've seen tutorials, obviously makeup tutorials, but um, I'm really lazy and I, I'm a fan, like number one fan of shortcuts over here. If there's a way that could get me to the same point and maybe be a little less quality, but get me there fucking quicker, like that's probably what I'm going to do. And if there's not a way already, I'll make a way. And honestly, people who do hand wise, like, it looks like that shit takes forever. So I'm just doing this like a fucking clown. I was like, be a fucking clown. Okay, and now, now it's time to apply the fucking blue. So maybe I'll just do like, I'll put like a coat down of this grand, grand prismatic. Is that, I feel like I'm not saying that right, but that's what it says. Okay, grand prismatic, which is basically the matte version of old Jeff, the sparkly blue one. I wonder how much of this video I'm gonna look back on and be like, wow, my fucking mouth is just hanging open and how short this video will be because of it. I'm gonna cut it out, like I'm not posting that. And again, I know my techniques are shit. You're not supposed to follow them, I keep telling you that. Don't do these. Ah! Okay, so yeah, I think I decided I'm gonna take Casper Mountain and Old Jeff and like, just like fuck them up and put them together. It's not bad. And I gotta fucking fix it and shit, but like, it's not bad. Congratulations, you played yourself. So, I mean, I gotta touch it up a bit, but like, we're getting there. There's like, I could see the, the finish line. So I need to add more brown for sure. Um, the darker one, Wyoming, the matte one. Ew, there's a hair in my brush. Like, it's, it's kind of there, right? Right? Like, are we, are we getting somewhere, guys? What do you think? Should I just stop? Unfortunately, I won't be able to uh, read your mind the moment and this video is obviously already filmed. So if you think I'm uh, doing horrible and you don't want to see anymore, you feel free to click off the video, leave a dislike, leave a hate comment, call me names. I give you permission and it's probably justified. So yeah, I think it's fucked. I'm gonna have to like try to fix this. I don't know, maybe, it's, maybe I'm just overthinking it, but it looks kind of bad. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. All. I think what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna use my finger, like the fucking animal I am, and just push that bitch back up. Shit's kind of hard. I feel like okay, it's kind of coming together now. I just gotta like buff it out somehow. 
me just like getting the product off the brush that's already there. Oh my God, it started out brown on my hand and now it's like yellow, okay. So this is my hand. <laughs> and that's basically how it looks at the end of every time I do my makeup. Cause I never clean my brushes when I probably really should. Okay, so I'm gonna use this and try to like, try to like buff that shit out. Why does this side look better than this side? Fuck. I did have to use a little bit of Jeffree Star's white shade. I can't remember what the fuck it's called, but he has like matte white shade. I don't know if he has more than one, but yeah. So I kind of tone it down around the edges a little more because I kind of, I always go too big. I always go too fucking big every time. I get a little ahead of myself and think I'm like doing something when I'm not. There's this so far. Now, hmm, to do eyeliner or not to do eyeliner? That is the fucking question. So I'm going to aim to do a wing like this on my other eye and that's usually where it goes wrong. So whenever I try to do like baby wings, they don't end up babies. They end up being full grown adult wings that are very independent. I think I actually did it. Oh, holy fucking hell, dude. Congratulations fucking me. Um, with this gold color uh, called Owl Eyes right there, the one that I really fucked up. So, might meet me. There we go. I'm gonna take the tiniest little bit, and just like, whoop. I know that's like so 2016, but I love that shit. Okay, deal with it. So I'm gonna do mascara, throw on some eyelashes, and I will be fucking back. <laughs> okay, so this is, voila, the final look, kind of. Since you're here, <laughs> I figured I'd just like do my blush and like, the final touches and shit. Uh, I just wanted to let you guys know, I'm actually going to be doing a giveaway on my Instagram for a free pair of shoes from this brand um, called Guy Sween or Guy Swain. Um, they actually gave me a free pair of shoes and are giving me a chance to give my followers on Instagram a chance to win a pair of shoes for fucking free for literally doing nothing. Um, so I will put the link to that in the description. If it's not there, if the link is not in my description yet, it will be soon. I'm not sure which I'm gonna get up quicker, the giveaway or this. So if you're interested in winning a over a hundred dollar value pair of shoes um, from a brand that like, it's like, everything's very like eco-friendly and honestly so fucking high quality i have a pair of shoes from them from before this and i also got my dad a pair and my dad he's 61 and he loves these shoes so like they aren't ugly like they're not like super like stylish but they're not ugly if that makes sense and these ones i believe that i'm gonna wear are the runner shoes so if you run like and like free shit check it out not that many people enter my giveaways for some reason like i don't know what's wrong with my followers but apparently they don't like free shit like someone could like get put up a giveaway to win like a free bunch of bananas i'd be entering that shit because it's free to enter like and i like free shit i don't see the need to like act like you're like above giveaways but um so if you're interested in that um i'm pretty sure all you're gonna have to do is like follow me follow them leave a comment possibly tag someone something to that degree i haven't fully decided yet but um, yeah there's that and I've used this highlight palette all to fuck. So I'm gonna use, I like doing like a combination of ice cold and canary bling from this one. Oh, now's the moment. See, we're like, we're coming together over here. I feel like we're getting there. So this is also Jeffree Star lip liner. <laughs> so I'm just like Jeffree Star's number one fan, I guess. I'm not like some psycho Jeffree Star like consumer. It's just that I don't like buying expensive makeup in He's the only one I ever tried, and I at least know he's like a pretty reliable brand as far as like consistency and quality. And I don't want to risk spending a lot of money on a, a different brand that I've never tried before. And like, I'm just, I'm, I'm cheap that way. The lighting outside is changing so quick, okay. The sun is suddenly rapidly going down. Final look. For someone who can't do makeup, I feel like this palette helps. It's like simple. It blends super, super good. I fucking love it. Like I have a few Jeffree Star palettes because like I just explained to you, I'm cheap. I stick to one fucking brand that's expensive, apparently. So 
I just wanted to do a little look on camera for fun. Cause someone asked me like a month or two ago whenever I did that unboxing and I was like, yeah. And then I didn't do it. So he, uh, yeah, here's for that person who I told yes to and forgot. <laughs> um, so here's that. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a like. If you disliked it, give it, a, give it a thumbs down. Just do it. Leave a hate comment, like I said. Fucking unsubscribe if you must. Thanks for watching, guys. And I will see you next time. Bye.